मेरे लिए क्योंकि आई मीन आई आई एव एन्जॉयड माय स्टिंट विथ मॉडलिंग ट्रिमेंडसली क्योंकि एड्स करना बहुत फन है यू नो यू यू मीट डिफरेंट डायरेक्टर्स यू डू डिफरेंट यू वर्क ऑन डिफरेंट स्क्रिप्ट्स यू गेट प्ले मेनी कैरेक्टर्स डू मेनी फन थिंग्स ट्रैवल एंड ऑल सो इट्स बिन इट्स बिन अर्ली फिन राइट एव डन अबाउट हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी कमर्शल्स नाउ सो आई रियली एन्जॉय द एड वर्ल्ड और उसके बाद मैंने तीन चार हिंदी फिल्म किए जो द कैरेक्टर्स ऑफ विच वर वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग जो काफ़ी स्ट्रॉन्ग कैरेक्टर्स हैं जो लड़की सिर्फ नाचती नहीं है दो आई आई शुड टेल यू आई लव डांसिंग ना लेकिन यू नो क्वाइट क्वाइट सब्सटेंशियल एंड क्वाइट स्ट्रॉन्ग द कैरेक्टर्स वर्स आई रियली एन्जॉय दैट एंड नाउ टू डू टू डू वर्क इन द वेस्ट इज ऑल्सो वेरी डिफरेंट बिकॉज ऑफ हाउ देर राइटिंग इज देर राइटिंग देर स्क्रिप्ट देर कैरेक्टर्स देर थीम्स आर वेरी डिफरेंट फ्रॉम वॉट वी डू इन इंडिया सो टू बी एबल टू एक्सपेरिमेंट एंड अंडरस्टैंड देर क्वालिटी ऑफ सिनेमा एज uh in addition to what we do here is is quite a lot of fun so i mean it's a great learning experience i've i've had some you know good experiences i've had some bad experiences but it's all been a great learning um curve and uh, very enjoyable and touch wood i'm very happy um sensate is uh, for netflix which is um something that's only in other countries it hasn't come to india yet um or the the story i'm going to explain this in english because it's easier um is about eight people from around the world who are completely unrelated and they witness like this really tragic incident together and after that they become mentally and emotionally linked and um uh, they can you know they can travel to other places even though they physically still in their own land um and even as they're trying to understand how that's happening to them they also realize that their souls are being hunted um which can affect the future of mankind and so they have to um fight to protect themselves so i mean it's it's a it's a intense human drama on a sci-fi premise but it also has action and romance and comedy and all of that so it caters to all kind of uh, tastes and um i play the role of kala who is a scientist uh, from mumbai and uh, i am i have a good a uh, sort of uh, paradoxical character because on one hand i believe in god very strongly so there's faith and religion on one side and then on the other side i am a scientist so there's the thing about facts and science so it's, she she she's got like science on one side and she's got faith on one side so it's a good sort of um split to have to deal with um and and also there are other plot themes that that continue uh, but it's it's also uh, been shot extensively across nine countries from around the world uh, mexico city san francisco chicago um london reykjavik nairobi korea uh, mumbai and seoul so it's been uh, exhaustive it's been we've shot at live locations we haven't used any sets um and it kind of uh, affects the fabric of the story when you shoot at live locations and um the cast is truly multinational because people from around the world have actually been cast it's not one sort of culture so um it the this, this, the story attempts to deal with various things like i your your true identity and your sexuality and your um action yeah it it, it has yeah. everything you know so it's um it's really dealt with several issues at the same time and um yeah i mean i can i can go on talking about various things about the show but it's just it's very interesting and it premieres june 5th um you know that that's one of the things that the show actually deals with the the thing that we're all so culturally different because of the various mm. lands that we belong to but if you break that down if you peel away those layers at the end of it we're all still the same sort of human beings so even though we're culturally different we all still are the same and you actually experience that because when you meet someone for the first time you know you see you sense the difference in terms of accent in terms of um language in terms of understanding and all of those things but give it a few days and everyone's the same we all just connect as human beings at a basic level and that's really what the show deals about as well the fact that we're all so different and yet we're all still the same um and when you travel to e- each place you know you understand about the way they live their life mm-hmm. and the way they think and operate and um it makes you question what your your beliefs are because you're brought up 
to, to understand the world in a certain way. And in another land, they don't think that way at all. They think very differently. Their rights and wrongs are different. What they think is culturally right is very different from what you believe. So it makes you realize that after all, we live based on man-made um, rights and wrongs, you know, and, and that changes around the world. Like um, in India, you don't let older people carry your bags. In India, you don't let older people carry your bags or you don't let older people uh, walk too far. You kind of look after them. But uh, when I was in London recently, this much older man, much older man insisted that he hold my bags and I was like, no, but you know, I can't burden you. And then he insisted on dropping me all the way home, even though it was really late at night. And I was like, no, but I'm, I'm, I'm close. I can make it on my own. I don't want you to walk extra, but you know, it's this. And um, s several other things, I mean, Nairobi feels differently about things, Seoul feels differently about things. You know, when you touch someone's feet, they don't understand it. So, I mean, it's just really great to see um, those differences and, and, and realize that you can just broaden your thought process quite a lot if you allow yourself to. Uh, Mr. Kerr plays my father and uh, I re truly enjoy working with him because he is someone I worked with on my first film, Ye Fasli, um, and he takes tremendous interest in my performance. He's always very alert. So, you know, even somehow if he's you know, sitting in that side of the room, he still pays attention to what I am doing and he'll, he'll be like, don't do this or do that or change this or keep that, or, you know, whatever. He's constantly like, like giving me pointers, which is very sweet for for him to be that interested in what I do. Um, and he's also, you know, he's uh, uh, someone I enjoy like fooling around with, like he's quite, I like bullying him and he allows me to bully him, so that's a lot of fun, you know, considering that he's Mr. Kerr. Um, but, you know, we have that sort of great rapport and, and I enjoy that and uh, working on Sensei, it was very different from working on Yefasli, Yefasli was a very intense sort of film and in this one I play the spoiled not spoiled, but I play daddy's little girl in this, in, in Sense8, um, you know, where I, but we also have a friend, uh, sorry, we also have a relationship of being really good friends, so I'm someone who discusses all my problems with my father in Sense8, so we have this um, relationship of respect, uh, respect and trust, but also great friendship and um, ease. So it was nice to play that sort of thing with him um, a second time around. Um, Mr. Kher, uh, actually, sabhi characters ke um, apne apne stories hai. So agar um, San Francisco ka story hai, to us ladki ki jo bhi relatives hai, family hai, friends hai, work relationship. So sab ke characters me, um, you know, individual storylines hai. And uh -huh. then we also connect, eight of us also connect. So um, every city has uh, an entire storyline happening. So uh, the Indian story, there's also Pura Bholi, there's also um, Meeta Vashish, there's Darshan Jariwala. So we have a very good, strong lineup of Indian actors as well as international actors. Um, I think mainly Hollywood may. The main difference would be uh, writing ke styles but alag hai, okay, jo themes hai, plots hai, characters hai, bohat alag hai. Um, yahan pe we, I like, I think we, you can't generalize but uh, we like fantasy films a lot more in India and I think there, um, but you know that's happening there as well so it's very hard to generalize but I will say that the way they, they their writing style is very different from our writing style um, but I think the language of cinema is the same universally um, and so I don't sense that difference. I think the, the main difference comes from the sort of script you're working on. If you're working on a comedy then that kind of affects the entire process of the film or the, or the show that you're making, if you're making a drama, if you're making a thriller, if you're making a horror, that affects your experience, not so much Hollywood or Bollywood. Um, but yes, because of it being a different language and because of it being a different culture, the sort of um, uh, performance that one would give when you're working in Hindi and when you're working in English changes automatically because even if you speak Italian, your body language changes when you speak in um, Thai, maybe your, you know, your body language changes, your accent changes, your, your, um, it, it affects your performance, the language you speak in the, and, um, and so it broadens your horizons again when you're working in the West because as Indians we have a certain type of body language and when you see them because they're from a different culture, they have a different sort of body language, so you kind of adopt that um, when you have exposure to it. So I think that would be the main difference, not so much anything else. 
आई रियली होप अभी नेटफ्लिक्स इंडिया में नहीं है सो so oh. इसलिए रिलीज इंडिया में रिलीज नहीं होगी हो अभी के लिए आई डू होप नेटफ्लिक्स कम्स टू इंडिया सोन एंड देन एवरी वन इन इंडिया बी एबल टू सी इट बट दे आर देव ऑलरेडी रिलीज वन ट्रेलर एट मोर ट्रेलर्स कम आउट नेक्स्ट वीक एंड दे प्लान लाइक रियली एलेबरेट प्रमोशनल स्ट्रैटीज for the release of sense eight but um hopefully in a year or two if it comes to india then we'll all you know promote it like crazy here and maybe have a launch or something as well uh main aaj raat book rest ke liye nikalne wali hu um for an ad uh an indian ad um and uske baad i'm going directly to san francisco jo sense eight ke launch ke liye aur phir phir la for you know meetings and other work so it's it's quite a long trip i'm going away for a month and a half And um, and then you know and then I come back. But it'll be a fun trip. I'm going for work also, and I'm gonna also meet some friends and maybe go to Disneyland. So it'll be fun. Um, it's it's rightly like you said. I've done um, work in Bollywood so far, and many two Bollywood films be kiye, British films kiye hai. Best Exotic Marigold and then second Best Exotic Marigold Hotel. But in ye ek American show hai, American TV series Netflix ke liye, aur ye bahot um, in. Uh, बहुत ही अलग कैरेक्टर है क्योंकि इट्स अ साई फाई ड्रामा एंड आई प्ले एन इंडियन गर्ल येस बट इन वेरी वेरी डिफरेंट सेटअप सो काफ़ी इंटरेस्टिंग स्टोरी है जो साइंस फिक्शन के ऊपर बेस्ड है जो एक आठ लोग कनेक्ट होते हैं और मैं बॉम्बे में एक साथ ऐसा होता है शो में कि आई एम इन बॉम्बे एंड बर्लिन एट द सेम टाइम यू नो अकॉर्डिंग टू द शो सो इट्स वेरी यूनिक कॉन्सेप्ट और आपको बहुत सोचने को का मौका देंगे क्योंकि बहुत सारे इश्यूज हैं जो डिस्कस होते हैं शो में सो इट्स वेरी पाथ ब्रेकिंग जैसे वो चाउस की जो राइटर्स एंड डायरेक्टर्स हैं उन्होंने इसके पहले क्लाउड एटलिस और मेट्रिक्स जैसे बड़े फिल्म्स बनाए हैं तो द कॉन्सेप्ट्स आर नोन टू बी रियली इंटरेस्टिंग एंड यूनिक सो यू गेट टू सी मोर ऑफ दैट ऑन ऑन सन ऑन सेंस एट सो प्लीज वॉट इट्स इट्स राइटली लाइक यू सेड आई हैव डन वर्क इन बॉलीवुड सो फार एंड मैंने दो हॉलीवुड फिल्म भी किए हैं ब्रिटिश फिल्म किए हैं बेस्ट एक्जॉटिक मैरी गोल्ड एंड देन सेकेंड बेस्ट एक्जॉटिक मैरी गोल्ड होटल लेकिन ये एक अमेरिकन शो है अमेरिकन टी वी सीरीज नेटफ्लिक्स के लिए और ये बहुत इन बहुत ही अलग कैरेक्टर है क्योंकि इट्स साई फाई ड्रामा एंड आई प्ले एन इंडियन गर्ल येस बट इन वेरी वेरी डिफरेंट सेटअप सो काफ़ी इंटरेस्टिंग स्टोरी है जो साइंस फिक्शन के ऊपर बेस्ड है जो एक आठ लोग कनेक्ट होते हैं और मैं बॉम्बे में एक साथ ऐसा होता है शो में कि आई एम इन बॉम्बे एंड बर्लिन एट द सेम टाइम यू नो अकॉर्डिंग टू द शो सो इट्स वेरी यूनिक कॉन्सेप्ट और आपको बहुत सोचने को का मौका देंगे क्योंकि बहुत सारे इश्यूज हैं जो डिस्कस होते हैं शो में सो इट्स वेरी पाथ ब्रेकिंग जैसे वो चाउस की जो राइटर्स एंड डायरेक्टर्स हैं उन्होंने इसके पहले क्लाउड एटलिस और मेट्रिक्स जैसे बड़े फिल्म्स बनाए हैं तो द कॉन्सेप्ट आर नोन टू बी रियली इंटरेस्टिंग एंड यूनिक सो यू गेट टू सी मोर ऑफ दैट ऑन ऑन सेंस एट सो प्लीज वॉच ओ गॉड सो मैनी आई लाइक जॉनी डेप एंड हेलन बॉनम गार्टर आई थिंक द वेरी अनयूजल इन द चॉइस ऑफ roles that they have in and in their performances they're not they don't play run of the mill characters or or um real characters they play fantasy based things like jack sparrow and and you know when you see dark shadows when you see edward scissorhands they don't play normal human beings they play different sort of characters which is very interesting to see how they can bring to life something that's imagination based mm-hmm.